Okay, well. <clears throat> hey, y'all, Miles J here. So stop. Camera time. Before y'all get into the rest of this video, I'm gonna need y'all to watch the first hair video that I did. There's gonna be a little eye up here you can click, or you can click the link down below. And it's gonna answer all your questions about the hair care products I used when I was washing my hair, slash conditioning it, all that other crap. Now, I got that silk press a little over two weeks ago. I don't know how long you're supposed to wait, um, and I didn't care. The ends of my hair were getting really frizzy, which is to be expected. I will say I did sleep without wrapping it, you know. It was a rough night and she needed to go straight to bed. Luckily, I do have a silk pillow, but that didn't keep it from getting frizzy. And then, you know, as I was taking my showers, you know, some of that water would seep in and get to my edges and then they would start to get frizzy. And by the time that we were on week two, um, I was ready to have my curls back. And plus, I wasn't able to like really wash my hair at all. And I really didn't want to put any heat on it after my hair started to revert a little bit in the back because, you know, I already done put so much on it the first time I went and got it pressed. I just let her be, let her do her own thing. And when it was time, it was time. I'm really bright. Oh my God. Let me, let me turn this. Let me turn this shit down. How do I do this? Okay. We're not looking quite as Caucasian. So, ooh, I really need to get some Botox. Like these... This is from years of wearing wigs and pulling. Did you see? You s anyway, I'm distracted. So I washed my hair. Uh, Y'all don't really need to know the products that I use to wash my hair because one, you're probably gonna be ashamed. Well, I wouldn't say ashamed, but they're very random. I got this like tea tree knockoff brand from Sally's Beauty Supply and it was that white bottle with the, you know, and it leaves my scalp really minty. Y'all wanna know what the My heater's on. Why is my heater on? I really need to buy new shampoo, conditioner, and, you know, hair care products, basically, is what I'm trying to tell you. Anyway, anyway. After I wet my hair, I noticed that um my curls didn't really, like, I mean, they, they shrunk back up, but not all of them. Where is she at? Little Miss Hunty, I think this is her right here. This is the culprit she right here, right up in this bit. She was like, actually, you know what? After being curly for so long, I think I'm straight. And that's great, you know, if you're a human being. Not if you're a strand of my hair. It's not gonna, it's not how it works, sis, I'm sorry. Um, get the fuck in line. Get in line. I've twisted my hair again today, as you guys can see, and I'm just gonna take it down for you guys. I hope it comes out the way I want it to. We're just gonna undo these twists, sweetie, and hope for the best. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. This is taking too long. And this is the finished look. Um, this is incredible. Like, never have I ever, like, experienced this kind of texture on my hair. Like, girl, look at this. Look at this coil. Y'all see that shit? My hair has never done that. Manipulation or not. Like, I've done twists before. And my twists never look like that. Now maybe I was doing them wrong. I was probably doing them wrong. I'm gonna be honest. I'm shook. I'm shooken. I'm shook. Like, it, my hair looks good. Like it looks great. Looks amazing. Looks healthy. Looks incredible. But the, you know, my texture, this, you see homegirl right there? She's mama say, mama sa, mama kusai, and all the way the fuck down into my eyebrow. And, I'm not really mad at it. I'm really not. Getting my hair silk pressed gave me an opportunity to play with my hair texture. And if you guys are new to my channel, I used to have my sides shaved. So both sides were like shaved all the way down for my Storm cosplay. And it took a long time for her to catch up to the hair on top of my head, which was not shaved. So there was a really long, awkward phase of hair growth on the side of my head. So she was tucked thoroughly underneath a wig cap 
for a while, a very long time, because just like when I wore my natural hair out, I looked, I felt like I looked fucking ridiculous just because my sides, there was nothing I could do, nothing I could do. So now that they're a stylable length, I feel like I can probably wear my natural hair out often, but this starts a new relationship with my hair and what she can do and what she is capable of. So watch out. Ooh, what the fuck? What the fuck is that? That's it for this little hair the, the, the thing. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, it's been me, Miles J. Make sure to follow me on social media accounts and shit like that. So that way you know what the fuck I'm up to, what the fuck is going on, and you're not one around lost wondering why Miles hasn't made a video. So until next time, it's been me, Miles J. I'll talk to you guys all later. <laughs> oh.